Kokdugi or diced radish kimchi is a variety of kimchi in Korean cuisine. Usually, it has all the ingredients of kimchi, but the beku, hongul, beku napa cabbage used for kimchi is replaced with Korean radish called mu, mu in Korean. Kokdugi is a popular banchan side dish enjoyed by Koreans and others. Origin the origin of kokdugi is mentioned in a cookbook named Joseon Yorihak, Joseon Iolahag Chow Xian Liao Li Ze, literally, Korean Gastronomy, written by Hong Son Pyo, Hong Pyo in 1940. According to the book, kokdugi was created by Princess Suksian, Suksinongju Shu Shan Wang Zhu, a daughter of King Zhengzhou, R. 1776 1800, and the wife of Hong Hyeon Ju, Hong Hyeonju Hong Xian Zhou, a high ranking government officer titled as Yang Myongwi. Yang Myongwi Yang Ming. When a matter for congratulation happened to the royal court, members of the royal family gathered to have a feast, and the princess presented a new dish made with diced radish to the king. He highly praised it and asked her about the dish's name. She replied that the dish did not have a name because she had accidentally made it, but found that it tasted good, so she brought in the new dish to the court. The king replied that the dish would be named kokdugi because cutting food into cubes is called gakdok zeolji kagdukzeolji in Korean. At that time, kokdugi was called gakdokji gagdugi kedukchi and then became spread over commoners. Preparation Kokdugi consists of radish cut into small cubes. The radish is flavored with salt, red chili powder, spring onions, and ginger. The radish and the other ingredients are mixed together and then traditionally stored in a jangdok, hongul, jangdog or ongji, hongul, ongji hanja, wengchi both names which refer to a large earthenware pot. Fermentation takes about two weeks in a cool, and dry place. Kokdugi is served cold and is usually consumed when the radish is crisp. This is before the radish becomes soft. Kokdugi, along with other types of kimchi, is a popular dish in Korea and is believed to share many of the health benefits of kimchi, due to the fermentation process. Varieties There are several main types of kokdugi, which are all fairly similar in their ingredients and preparation. Regular kokdugi Gul kokdugi, gulkagdugi is a variety of kokdugi that is flavored with whole raw oysters. It is made especially in winter around Korean New Year. Seuho, salted preserved shrimp, and water dropwort leaves, along with other spices, are used for making this. Because of the use of oysters, gul kokdugi has a comparatively short shelf life compared to other types of kokdugi. It is most often consumed in Jeju Island and Seoul. Gejimu kokdugi Gejimu kogdugi is made with gejimu gejil radish, a local specialty of the Yoju region. Myeongti seodiori kokdugi Myeongtashidiola kagdugi is made with the gills of Alaska pollock. Myeongti refers to the fish and seodiori means the offal of fish in Korean. Sup kokdugi Sub kagdugi is made with diced radish that has been boiled, so it is reputed to be more easily digestible and therefore good for old people. Musongsongi Musong is a form of kokdugi once consumed in the royal court, whose name derives from the adverb, songsong, songsong because the radish used for it is chopped and diced small. Seolongtang Korean soups such as seolongtang, beef soup, galbitang, galbi, or beef rib soup, samgatang, ginseng chicken soup are considered good friends. For kokdugi, the taste of the kokdugi overpowers the taste of stew itself and gets rid of the distinctive smell of the stew. Additionally, radish is very good for digestion. When eating meat in stew, kokdugi is believed to aid in digestion. See also Korean radish References